scripture say the scriptures say on that day the sun rose over Sodom. It's a beautiful day. Headed to mass, man. It's a beautiful day. Blue skies, I'm in the country, so I gotta head on to mass. Uh, it's about two miles from here and I got an hour to get there. So this is the jail, the Albion, whatever jail, and the directions have me going towards that jail. They must be crazy. Almost getting to mass now. Uh, about it's a good thing to go to mass on on some Friday. It's the day of the Lord's Passion. You know, Jesus Christ died for you, man. You know what I'm saying? It's just a good day to spend with the Lord. He strengthens you in your spiritual battle. Most of these churches in the cities and in small towns across America are now empty. They'll probably shut down. Spiritual decay. It's the first stage of the economy decaying. If, if, if spiritual decay preludes um, economic decay, if you look at most of these places where the churches are closed, especially the Roman Catholic Church, there's economic decay. Go to Detroit, go to Buffalo. You know, where everywhere the Catholic Church is closed, things ain't good. That's what I'm, that's just my opinion. It's not a fact. It's based on the limited places I've been, so it's not a fact, really. Okay, made it to Mass. I have to cut the, the camera off now. Our Lady, please pray for us. Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. came for Mass and uh, Eucharistic Adoration. Time to go on. Time's around 153, just left the city. The town went to Mass, received the Holy Eucharist, went to the Latin Mass today, and went to spend an hour in front of the Blessed Sacrament. It's a blessed day. It doesn't get sweeter than that. Get my snack on. Drying up some stuff right there. Because I slept in them damps, man. Things soaking wet. Damps. You know what I mean? Water at night. Cold. See how beautiful the country is around here? All this beauty. People fail to see it because we're so focused on our sins, our pettiness. God made all this stuff. Friday, the Lord's Passion. The day is almost over. Fruitful day. Went to Mass. Went to the Eucharistic adoration for about an hour with Jesus Christ. I didn't go to confession though. You know, and on, on one thing, every Friday try to help the poor. Try to do something in honor of the Lord's passion. It might be buying a can of beans and living in front of the store. It might be giving somebody a dollar. It might be giving somebody a quarter. Just do something in remembrance of Jesus Christ. And cut down on the meat. You know what I'm saying? There ain't no need for you to be eating meat. There's a benefit for that. Your heart will thank you later. Every time we do stuff for God, we're blessed. But try giving up on the meat on Friday. Don't make it public. If people give you meat, eat it. Don't tell nobody. If there's people there and they'll make you suspect it, forget it then. You know what I'm saying? Just do something for the Lord's passion, man. I'm trying to, but it's not easy. But if we encourage one another and then you hit me up, say, I, I tried it. I can do it. Then I'll learn from you, man. You know what I'm saying? Just do something. It's one thing, one little thing in honor of the passion of our Lord, man. It ain't got to be nothing big. You people think I got to give $100,000. God don't see that. God sees the intention. Every Friday, so okay, I'm going to do, even spend, get a can of hot dogs. Just put it somewhere where people take it. No a lot of hungry people out here. Peace be with your name of Jesus.
When I start filming some stupid bike, gotta break all the silence, man. Forty-eight p.m. Uh, late August. It's gonna be dark. I gotta find a place to camp. Lord willing, there's a church down the road. I might get there. Just how dark it is out here, man. There's houses there and everything. Must be out in the suburbs in the country. Beautiful out here, but then, you know, I just pray that God watch over me and the Blessed Virgin Mary and, and, and St. Joseph on the flight to Egypt. Walk through the valley of death, Lord. I'm helpless out here. I don't see my back. I ain't got nothing on me. It's almost nine o'clock. I'm behind this church. I'm hoping to camp here at night and wake up early in the morning. Left behind this church, and I'm seeing that they got a no trespassing sign here. Wow, I gotta get out of here. I ain't know that. Get arrested for that. This place is crazy, that's why they got all these no trespassing signs, I guess there are a lot of crazy people here. Roger. 8.23, just cleared up my camp, uh, getting ready to hit the road. Walking down the road, too many people here, all these cars, taking out the fun out of the hike, but it's a cross. I ran up on some wheat on the side of the road, so I'm eating it. Lord says, unless the grain of wheat falls to the earth, it remains a grain of wheat. So I'm going to try to process it and show you what it looks like for all you big city rats. They got the wheat. Let me get with you. There's the wheat. I separated it. That's what Jesus says, man. That unless we die to the things of this world, their traffic, the noise, we remain worthless. Think of the people. Think of it like this, man. Think of Mother Teresa or, or St. Francis or Francis or St. Benedict. And then think of the richest person in that time who lived for women and cars and houses. What's the difference? That's what our Lord is telling us, man. Unless you're going to... Creek. You know what that means, right? Your boy's time for the boy to take a shower. God gave us water. He makes the creek flow. You know, God is good. You know what I'm saying? Like, I could take a shower in there, man. Clean up, freshen up. You know what I mean? That's what I'm about to do. Thank you, Jesus, for this, man, because I stank, man. I smell like trash, man. I just can't go on that on that on that part of the that's private property, but this right here stay property, so I'm good. Those fishes in there, man. Feeding off of that piece of rice right there. Thirsty little creatures. Uh, I'm outside of Rochester, and I'm trying to figure out what to do. I don't want to stay around here, kind of crazy people around here, you know, that type of that. You know what I mean? It's not just get a different vibe, but I want to get into the city, so I'm trying to figure out what I do. Dear God, what I do. Uh, let me just go, and whatever happens, trust in God. The Bible says, worry not, man. We ain't supposed to worry about nothing. I'm trying. Sometimes you get rifled up. 825. I gotta get there to get on the bus. I, I, I don't know what, what's gonna happen here, but I'm just gonna keep moving. Sun going down in this little town. I'm out here waiting on the bus. I don't know if it's even gonna come, man. I hope it does. You know, just chilling, man. I'm in, close to the city of Rochester. Downtown Rochester, so I gotta find some internet now. In a hectic, God bless me. I got here, kind of getting used to the city. 
after being in the country.